Is this really why you are angry? <laughs> because I refuse your offer of sharing? Is that really why you are If you're a writer or a painter, you write or paint whenever you want to. But we have to do this task at a precise moment. At three minutes past eight, the curtain goes up, and you've got to pretend to believe. Because no one else will believe you unless you believe it yourself. A great deal of our work is simply making ourselves dream. That is the task. At three minutes past eight, you must dream. Sir Ralph Richardson. I'm David Sittler, uh, I'm the class of 1979, and I'm an actor. down in Long Branch, New Jersey, at the New Jersey Rep, where I'm doing my last weekend of Butler. It's a great new play by Richard Strand. Uh, it takes place at the beginning of the Civil War, and that was the reason I got these mutton chops. I usually like to get here a little earlier, because I always like to do a physical and a vocal warm-up. Me, by bo, you. Wow, back, who back, wow, back, who back. Uh, gets the mouth moving, your articulator's going. Uh, the lips, the teeth, the tip of the tongue. You basically just want to get your mouth going, you know. Let's go do a show. So I had two callbacks this morning, and I go to the first callback, and things are really well. I felt good about that. Went to the second callback. Again, they love the look. I get a call from my agent saying they want to see you back at the first callback. So I went back, and that's the actor's life. You gotta be ready. I'm an actor primarily because of F and M. Although I have to go back a little further than that. Uh, when I was in second grade, I was the front of the cow in the Ugly Duckling. Then you flash forward. I just graduated Penn Manor High School, and I was cast in 1776. I met Hugh Evans, who was the director of the summer rep company at the Fulton Opera House. And from that summer, I knew that this was something I wanted to do. And from that summer, I knew I also wanted to go to F and M. Yeah, here's the Aura Flame, 1979, and uh, there's my yearbook photo in front of the green room. <laughs> wow, that seems a little bit long ago. That, that's actually me. <laughs> uh, this was the first Broadway show I did. Uh, an inspector calls. And uh, to be able to work in New York City for nine months was, was just an amazing thing. Hi, boys. Well, hey, hey, how's it going, going Ace? Here, man? What's up? <laughs> this is two of the cast guys. This is uh, Lieutenant Kelly, and this is Butler right here. In Germantown Avenue, we had a vintage clothing shop. Mm -hmm. They had doors, but no way I was going to leave. Gentlemen, there's a man too lazy to work. You try my patience, sir. I don't believe I care about trying the patience <laughs> of a horn swaggering jackanape. <laughs> my gentlemen would not resort to petty insults. No, sir. You are correct. It was a great show. We had a great house. Uh, the audience has really responded well to the show. We were thrilled about it. And uh, this is going on almost 160 plays for me now. So, onward. <laughs>